What's up guys? Just doing a quick vid here showing some pistols that I uh, commonly carry uh, pretty often that are not uh, your typical Micro 9s that uh, we see a lot of from the Glock 43s to the uh, P365s and Hellcats and all that but uh, just some old school offerings that uh, sometimes people forget about that are still out there and you can get it at a pretty good price sometimes too did some videos on this one recently this is the uh, just the old school Glock 23 the a little bit more compact version than the uh, the night or the 17 and the 22 and the 40 I went uh, went and put some corn out where I deer hunt this weekend and there are black bear there I've got them on camera so I had this with me uh, loaded up with uh, 200 grain hard cast so I did not feel uncomfortable. I feel like uh, this would be sufficient to maybe do a mag dump if needed, but generally the bears don't jack with you. But just in case, have that one. And then the old school, uh, this is an early Gen 5. Uh, Glock 17 and 9mm. That's hard to beat. Just have that, you know, around your nightstand, or around the house for pretty much anything and you've got close to 20 rounds of 9 mil on certain magazines it's just a good one and then people forget about the old Beretta this is the M, the civilian M9 but uh, made to model after the, uh, the military's recent retirement to M9 did this one with some uh, Wilson combat parts it's a uh, Wilson uh, all steel guide rod, steel short reach trigger, Wilson extended mag release, and the uh, safety decocker, Wilson Comet. He's come with those. When you get these, they have a sight that's kind of a. Let's see if I can get that. To... In there, it's a painted half zero in between the green dots, and then it was a white dot. Uh, so I just took some uh, some neon nail polish and just put those in there. And those uh, those existing holes that weren't painted, so I can see that a lot better. My eyes are getting older, so that's just a lot better. But anyway, just wanted to do show you some other offerings out there and let you know what's available. Uh, most of this stuff you can pick up at Brownells too. So give it a look. All right, there you go.